In this question, we're told that the first four terms of a Fibonacci sequence are a, 2a, 3a, and 5a. We're then told that the sum of the first five terms of the sequence is equal to 228, and we need to work out the value of a. Let's first start by defining what a Fibonacci sequence is. Now, a Fibonacci sequence is one where each number in the sequence is the sum of the two numbers that came before it. For example, if we see the third term, we can see that it's the sum of the first term and the second term, because a plus 2a is equal to 3a. And if we look at the fourth term, we can see that it's the sum of the two numbers before it, because 2a plus 3a is equal to 5a. And so we can use this definition of a Fibonacci sequence in order to find the fifth term of the sequence. But now since we said that Fibonacci sequence is one where each number is the sum of the two numbers that come before it, we can say that the fifth term must be equal to the third term plus the fourth term. We can see that third and fourth terms are 3a and 5a, and so the fifth term must be equal to 3a plus 5a, which is equal to 8a. And so we found that the fifth term is equal to 8a. Now we're told that the sum of the first five terms in the sequence is equal to 228. The sum of the first five terms would be equal to a plus 2a plus 3a plus 5a plus 8a. And we can say that this is all equal to 228. Now we can simplify this because a plus 2a plus 3a plus 5a plus 8a is equivalent to 19a. And so we can say that 19a is equal to 228. To find the value of a, we can divide both sides by 19. 19a divided by 19 is equal to a, and 228 divided by 19 is equal to 12. And so we've found that the value of a is equal to 12. Now this question is worth three marks. We get the first mark for finding that the fifth term of the sequence is equal to 8a. We get the second mark for setting up the equation a plus 2a plus 3a plus 5a plus 8a is equal to 228. And we get a third and final mark for simplifying and rearranging in order to find that the value of a is equal to 12. Allowing us to achieve the full three marks needed in this question.